Roxy out and she's come in for our two week in house training. So I want to put a little bit on tape. She's real nervous, you know, I mean, this is, um, you know, as far as this goes, this is kind of confidence issues. Um, you know, most of these dogs don't have these kind of issues. So, you know, it's a little disconcerting because you want to see. Okay, I've got Roxy out and she's come in for our two week in-house training. So I want to put a little bit on tape. You know, we try to get them out with day one, within the first couple of days they're here. Roxy's been a little nervous. I tried to let her settle in for a few days. Um, she's still being pretty nervous, but she did like to get out of the kennel. So I think we've got some, you know, room for improvement, you know, some room for some confidence and stuff like that. Um, we'll get her outside that fence line and see what she does there. Um, you know, but right now we're just going to see how she acts and what she's doing. Hi, baby girls. Huh? It's okay. I know, huh? Just real nervous, not sure about anything. Not real sure what's going on, <laughs> what she's supposed to do. All right, come on, let's go for a walk. Come on. Hey, Roxy, can you see it? Good girl, look at dear, huh? So she doesn't know how to sit. Good, oh, and go, yummy treats, huh? Okay, so she does know a few things. She's doing okay with the treats. She didn't seem to mind those. She does know what sit means. Hey, Roxy, good girl, sit. Awesome, good job. So we just need to get some of this confidence, you know, get her out and get her around other things. Um, maybe expose her to a few more things and, and see what, you know, maybe her personality comes up a little bit once she's, um, you know, kind of been here a few more days. Um, as of right now, you know, she's still a little nervous about all this, but this isn't too terribly bad. So we'll put her back up and get her back out at the end of week one and see how she's doing then. Good girl. Okay. She's at. Um, you know, confidence wise, she has a little bit of an issue. You know, if you just go straight for her or something like that, she gets a little nervous, you know. Um, so, you know, in a crowd or situation like that, she's going to be a little bit standoffish. Um, and, and I just, um, you know, I'm not sure how much. Hey, come here. Good girl. I'm not sure how much of that, you know, we're going to train out of. I think the confidence level will come up the more you work her. Um, and show her that everything's okay and everything's all right. Um, but I think otherwise everything's going well. She's kind of she's kind of come into this really well, doing very good. She loves to pick treats, um, so that's made that a lot more you know a lot easier for um, and everything like that. So we'll put her through her paces and show you what she's learned. Hey, wanna go? Come on, let's go for a walk. So that was ready to go before you were, huh? No pulling, no. See now she's gotten a lot of confidence and she's kind of barreling ahead. Come on. Come on, girl. No sniff. Good. Good girl. Uh -uh. Sit. Stay. Stay. We want her to stay right there until we ask her to move. All the way back to her side. And this is her favorite part. Okay. Good girl, I know, huh? Huh, I know, huh? I know, huh? Oh. All right, come on, let's go. Uh -uh. Whoop. Okay, come on. Did you get it? She lost her treat. Come on. Well, yeah, that's what happens when you swallow them home. Hey. So she's doing a little bit of push pull, you know, kind of setting the boundaries on the walks. So I'm going to kind of pull her in a little bit. Hey. Good girl. Hey, Roxy, come on. No. Good, there you go. Good girl, that's what I want. Good. Roxy. Good, Sid. That was automatic. See, you did that one just by yourself. Do another stay for me. Roxy. Stay. No. Stay. Good stay. Good 
girl. Okay. Take a shot. Take a shot. Did you get them both? All right. Come on. No pull. Pit bulls are notorious pullers. They like to get out to the end of the leash and really take control. So you've got to be consistent about it. If you don't want them to do that, if you don't want them pulling on you, you've got to make sure that they're not allowed to. Foxy, sit. Good. You want to play your favorite game? I know. Ready? Ready? Foxy, you're not watching. Get it. Come. Ready? Get it. Foxy, come. Hurry. You jump so high, you got your leash under your leg. Ready? Ready? Yeah. Foxy, come! Hurry, 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 hurry! You gotta get in here. Sit. Good. Ready? Get it. Foxy, come! Did you get it? Hurry! Foxy, come! Hurry! Awesome! Sit. Good girl. So as like she's doing really pretty good, um, even with her personality, you know, um, she's come a long way just in a few days because honestly she was, you know, really nervous about everything at first. Hey, Rox, sit. Good girl. Um, and, you know, um, she's still not a big fan of you just reaching for her really quickly. So when we put the collar on and off, we get her out of the kennel, get her to relax a little bit. Look at that, huh? Good smiles, huh? I love your smile, girlfriend. Um, you know, um, but we get her out of the kennel, get her to relax, and then we go um, and put the collar around her neck. So, um, you know, but otherwise, everything else is going really well. She's had some visits inside, where we're trying to get her inside and get her to greet everybody. So some of that confidence level comes up even for that. Um, but it's, it's just a work in progress. She's got a little bit more to learn this next week, um, but she will learn it um, because she's really, really working nicely. So we'll put her up and get her back out and take her at the end of the day and see how she's doing right before she goes home. Good girl, Roxy. Okay.